Weather blues continue in California. The latest storm in the U.S. state has prompted evacuations, power outages, while lands are soaked under floodwaters. A state of emergency has been declared in 43 of California's 58 counties. Meanwhile, forecasters have warned that another atmospheric river is preparing to hit the state next week. Details in our next report. Construction vehicles dump rocks along California's Parajo River to try to patch up a failed levee. After another deluge of rain this week hit the already saturated state, 10 inches in some parts, while the mountains received up to three feet of snow. Some 21,000 people in the flood zone had been under evacuation orders or warnings, officials said. Nearby farmland was soaked under the floodwaters. This is the latest so-called atmospheric river to hit the state. An airborne current of dense tropical moisture from the Pacific moving over the landscape. Nine of these storms lashed California from late December through mid-January, triggering widespread flooding, levee failures, mudslides, and punishing surf. Tuesday's storm was the 11th of the season. One local resident, Herberto Estrada, found his way home to rescue his birds that he'd left behind who were almost out of food. So he needed more food maybe for a couple of days. I don't know what time he's come back. Forecasters also warned of widespread uprooting of trees and down power lines from winds gusting up to 70 miles per hour. About 190,000 homes and businesses were without electricity Wednesday, mostly along California's central coast and the San Francisco Bay Area, according to data from poweroutage.com, a tracking service. That's about the same number of customers without power on the other side of the country. In the northeast and New England, a nor'easter storm dumped nearly two feet of snow in the Berkshire Mountains of western Massachusetts and northwestern Connecticut, and heaving snow fell in upstate New York.